Hey guys, now someone also asked for my recorder for a subscribe. Well, I need that one subscriber. So yeah, let's show it. So this is my recorder called Metal TV. If anyone already knew what it is. And uh, yeah, this is my recorder. Then after you downloaded the Metal TV, you're gonna come up here in this main menu. Then you're gonna go to settings. Then you're gonna add a game. You're gonna add Valorant continue just open the game first then press the continue or just read it the instruction you can read it there then go to recorder and here's my settings resolution i put it to medium because i have a low end laptop well i don't want to put it on low because it's probably gonna look so bad and if i'm gonna put in high or full hd i might get a high quality recording but i will also have two fps maybe <laughs> And in my FPS settings, I put it to 60. That's why it looks so s smooth. It recorded. I also don't want to put it to 30 because I don't want my recorder to look so laggy. Even though I have like 50 FPS in game, I still put it on 60 FPS because I want my video to look nice, you know, for you to give you a nice content. <laughs> so subscribe. And in the beach rights, I put it on 5M. I don't even know what M means. 5 million, maybe. <laughs> So I recommend you to just put it to, if you have a low end, just maybe put it to 3 million. But I think 3M is uh, so bad, so I'm just gonna use 5M and just click the CPU, auto. And here the length, I put it on 90 seconds. So here's the thing, that's why I like Metal TV than OBS because in Metal TV, you can only record the clip, you know, you can only record that moment, you don't need to record the whole game you're gonna stress and just cut it cut it on edit it's gonna cost you a lot of cpu usage but in metal tv you're only gonna record 90 seconds of that um moment so i'm gonna show you how just go to hot case and here i have um f8 that's the default one if you you know like you have ace you ace that round you're just gonna press f8 and then it will automatically record that 90 seconds before the F8. Or maybe you can change it to 1 minute or 45 seconds or 30 seconds. But I recommend you to 90 seconds so you know it will be recorded the whole round. So you're not gonna miss anything special for your video. Then you scroll down, you're gonna find the video aspect ratio. As you can see, I have... um set mine to game aspect ratio that's why i have a black bars at my recording because i am recording at low resolution in game if i put it on stretch to fit 69 well it will be stretch you know it will be full screen but it will be cost a lot of cpu usage because you're gonna record a high quality video so it's gonna um you know destroy your fps then as i said you're gonna get to fps so i just put it on game aspect ratio and then you go to if you want to record full session recording you know that you want to record the whole entire game the four hours game well you're just gonna click here false session recording you're gonna, gonna press on then it will automatically record your whole game yeah you don't need to press anything you're just gonna open up the valorant then boom you're just gonna record the whole game la four hours playing and if also you want to record your audio or your mic you're just gonna go to audio device and just turn it on then boom that's easy so yeah that's all that's how i record my gameplay